What if you could get paid to give your opinion? Sound too good to be true? Well, it's not. It could be as little as 30 minutes and it can be up to two hours. And so, and we always pay our respondents. Companies need feedback on products, appliances, and all sorts of things. In return, research companies in the Twin Cities compensate people for their time. WCCO's Jennifer Merrily found anyone can earn some extra cash. You gonna hide in there? Keep the paparazzi out. Kevin Youngquist is a working father of five. As far as budget, that every little bit helps. So when he learned a company was interested in his opinion to help with their research, he went for it. What a great opportunity to, to share mine and get paid for it. So it was uh, just a sweet deal. So this is where the client sits, sometimes for hours. Deborah Seem is vice president of Lead Research, a Twin Cities company hired to determine the usability of a website or to test a product. So we work with every type of client you can imagine. So every type of product that's out there that people would be using or having an experience with, clients could come to us for. Seem explains clients want to hear from real people about the usability of their product. Does it work the way they think it does? Where are they struggling? Where are, they, are we meeting their expectations? Is this website easy to use? Uh, and that's what we're trying to get answered by the end of the test. Her team searches for the client's target demographic to answer those questions. That's where you come in. Everyone is in our database. There isn't anyone that we would turn away. Sometimes lead calls people to come into the facility to be part of a research discussion. The client is on this side of the one-way mirror, watching while consumers are in the other room. Cameras capture the conversation. We want to record the session um, so we can go back and uh, get quotes or take images. People are also asked to do specific tasks. We do stuff where they might be in their home and we watch them prepare a meal and we watch how they use those products um, or you know how they are doing laundry um, so we can make a better uh, washing machine or dryer um, or they can be in store because uh, they might want to test the displays in the store. Are people seeing what they're supposed to see? Um, are, are they noticing the uh, advertising? The pay varies from $25 for a quick survey all the way up to $500 for a few hours of your time. The outcome benefits both sides. When products are usable, people want to use them and people want to buy them. And that's why um, market research is so important. Youngquist found it's worth his time. He gets called to participate a few times a year. It's not income his family counts on, but says a little something extra helps. And so it's a lot of fun to, to just have that, that fun money to say, you know what, we're going we're gonna to do this. We're going to do a splurge on, on date night. Jennifer Merrily, WCCO 4 News. Everyone involved signs a confidentiality agreement. There are a number of research companies in the Twin Cities. We have information on the latest studies and how to sign up at wcco.com links.